January 18, 1911, San Francisco Bay witnessed the birth of naval aviation as Eugene Burton Eli achieved the first ever takeoff and landing from a Navy ship, the USS Pennsylvania. With a makeshift 130-foot platform, sandbags, and ropes as a crude arresting system, Eli soared from suffrage field, landing his Curtis biplane skillfully on the Pennsylvania's stern to the awe of crowds. After a celebratory lunch with the ship's captain, Eli took off again, safely landing back at suffrage field. This daring feat, wearing a padded football helmet and bicycle inner tubes for safety, proved for the first time that aircraft could be taken to sea. Eli soon enlisted into the California National Guard Coast Artillery Corps, but tragically lost his life in a crash during a performance in October. For his groundbreaking contribution to naval aviation, the Navy posthumously awarded Eli with the Distinguished Flying Cross.